haul for you guys. I have a bunch of bags. I went shopping with my sister, my mom, and my dad, and I thought I would pick some stuff up that I can possibly haul for you guys. Haul for you? Does that make sense? So the first thing that I got was Mango Tango Twist. Um, this is a lotion. A lotion there. And it was on sale. It was 50% off, so for that. Yeah, so $8.75 for this. Not bad, not bad. And then I got another one, which is um, summer, I guess, summer themed. And this one is called Hawaii Passion Fruit Kiss, so it just looks like that. It's in a pink container like that. Really colorful. I love how like these containers just look like colorful. I bought a lotion. This is not a lotion. <laughs> this is a um, hand soap that has like those antibacterial beads in them. So. I really like this scent when I smelt it at the store. It's Pacific Coral Reef, so it just looks like that. These are also on sale because they're trying to get rid of like all their summer stuff, so that was really nice. Oh, I hate it when my, my scarf like creates like emptiness. Not cool. And then I got these three for $12.50 uh, lotions. So I got Sweet Pea Body Lotion, uh, Love and Sunshine Body Lotion, and then Beautiful Day Body Lotion. This one is my favorite. I actually finished the full size of this and when I finished it, it was so depressing because it had such sentimental value, like I've had it since I was in college, so it was kind of like, oh, I'm kind of sad <laughs> that I finished it. So I got some more lotions to bring to work and to use on the go. And then the last things, last items I guess that I got are three hand sanitizers. So I got one in Beautiful Day again and I kind of but scratched the front for some reason. Um, I also got Very Scary. This one smells really good. And this one is called Mad About You. So they changed their hand sanitizers. I think they're so adorable. I like these ones better, I think, than the old ones, but they're still small and they're still cute. So I love that. So the next um, store that I went to was a place called Urban Planet. And I don't know if they have it in the States, but in Canada they have it, so this is what the bag looks like, it's clean. Um, I only got like three things from there, but still it counts very So I got like a bunch of um, stud earrings. Uh, you can see like there's cross designs, there's birds, there's flowers, and it's just like everything. Like this can you can use for a long time, so I use studs all the time, so I thought I would get some more. <laughs> Next thing that I got is more earrings. Um, I wanted to try hoop earrings because I see people on YouTube all the time, especially my girlfriend. Not really my girlfriend, but my pretend to be girlfriend, Jenny Ho. She always wears um, hoop earrings and yeah, oh, it's getting dark. So she always wears hoop earrings and I wanted to try them out. And it also comes with like really big studs. So that's why I got it because I love studs. So I wanted to try those. But the last thing I got was a water bottle and basically, I don't know if you can see it, it just says too fit to quit. So I got that from Urban Planet as well and I thought it was so adorable and I love how it's like so big so I can fit like ice cubes and water. <laughs> and the last store, or I guess grocery store because that's really what it was, is um, Superstore. So. Woohoo! Plastic bags for the win! Does anyone recycle their plastic bags? Because I do. I use them for garbage. Am I the only one? No? The okay. first thing I got was a 3-pack of 3D pressed white toothpaste. And I do really like these because they I do notice a difference in um, my teeth. I guess they do, as they claim, they do make it wider. Like, I don't have any problems with this toothpaste in regards to my teeth becoming um, stained by like coffee or anything so I do highly recommend this toothpaste and a lot of youtubers rave about this too so go get you some toothpaste no oh, this is kind of embarrassing uh, there is a youtuber by the name of Jennifer and her username is from head to toe and she was totally raving about menstrual cups so I wanted to give it a try. They're pretty, it's pretty pricey. It's like $40 Canadian. I don't know how much that is in USD, but she did rave about it and she said that it changed her life. So I wanted to give it a try. So I got myself a Diva Cup. This is what the brand is called. And they do have um, multiple sizes. So 
the first model, which would be labeled in pink, but this one is blue, but the pink model is for people who haven't had babies. And since I did have a baby, I had to go for a model number two. And I think it's because, uh, probably because the vagina is probably wider, but yeah, that's what I got. So I'm excited to try this because my time of the month is coming soon. TMI, but yeah, I will probably do a review about this too and I'm excited so that's the diva cup um, I got a couple of makeup items the first one that I got oh, someone's texting me. Um, is the physicians formula touch of glow foundation nude wear it just looks like that and it comes with a brush so I'm excited to try this I'm gonna do a review on this and hopefully you guys like it because Physicians Formula, like I love their products, so I'm excited to try this. It has a brush, it has cute packaging. Like, what more can you want, right? So yeah, I'm excited to try that out. Next, I have a couple of lip items. So the first uh, lip items that I got are these lipsticks from Joe Fresh. So they just look like they come in white packaging. So yeah, they just come in this packaging, and you can see the colors. So the colors that I got was this one. This one is. Kiss. This is the color, and if you swatch it, ooh, it's really light. I don't know. I don't know. So it just looks like that. Yeah, I don't know if I'm gonna actually like this. I'm not really a fan of like two pink. So this isn't even really neutral pink, even though in the two it looks neutral. But that's what it looks like. So this is what that looks like. It's a nude for sure. Like. I hope it doesn't look really bad, but... Oh, it feels really creamy. So that's that color. I don't know if you can see it right there. Very neutral and very creamy. Which is weird because I thought these were supposed to be matte, but... Yeah, it does say matte. Like, on the bottom, it says matte nude natural. I don't know. The last one I got was is called matte rose so this looks like that and then i'll take off all the stickers all the labels so yeah it just looks like a darker version of this so the packaging is really flimsy i'm kind of scared now <laughs> like it's nice but like it doesn't snap so i don't know how oh there we go you have to push it harder so yeah they come in a cute white packaging but like when I twist it, it's like really flimsy. So there's this one. This one is called Rose. And I'll just do a little swatch. I might like this one actually. So it's right here. So that's that. The next um, lip items that I got are these Joe Fresh Long Wear Liquid Lipstick. And I got four different colors. So I got a plum color, red, a nude and a pink color sorry I don't have the labels upright but whatever so these ones claim to be six hour long wear liquid lipsticks so I guess I can swatch these ones for you guys too since I've been swatching everything anyway oh my god there's so many labels <laughs> so this is what they look like there you go so here's a swatch of this I hope it doesn't stain my skin. Ooh, this one's pretty. So there's that color. This color is in, um, what color is this? Plum. So this one is plum. That's really nice, actually. It's a good fall color. So one here, and then Ooh, one. this one's bright. Oh, and the, the applicator is kind of neat. It's like a doe foot. I don't know if you can see. But it's flat, flatter. So I guess you get more precision with that. So that one is this color here. And kiss. So that's that color. So the very last thing that I got was a makeup, not makeup, what is this? <laughs> An eyeshadow palette from Maybelline and it's called the Blush Nudes. People have probably seen this like all over YouTube, so this is no surprise. So I just wanted to see what it would be like compared to the um, 
naked palette because apparently it looks like everyone's trying to copy them in some sort of way. So. And it comes with two um, applicators, sponge applicators. And yeah, I'm really excited to try this. It's very, so this one here is that. Yeah, it's not as pigmented, but I mean, I'll give it a try. I'll give it a go. It's right there. It's really shimmering too. So we'll see how that actually looks like on the eyes one day. So yeah, that was everything in my haul. I hope you guys enjoyed watching. Um, as always, please subscribe. It would help me a lot. I'll do more hauls for you guys as long as you keep liking. Um, I hope to do another haul sometime soon and I will definitely do a favorite on that Physicians Formula Foundation so stay tuned for that but um, otherwise I'll see you guys later. Bye!